What's up, guys? So, today's word is friends, um, and this is kind of a... Mm, I'm going to have a more of a serious kind of note to this video, um, because I have a whole heap of friends that are in a couple of different social groups, um, and yeah, there's a lot of like serious stuff that goes on with them, so I'm gonna, without mentioning any names, kind of go through the kinds of things that you should really kind of do for your friends. So the first one I'm gonna talk about is um, supporting your friends. Um, it's kind of important to just kind of just kind of accept them really and support them for whatever it is they have chosen in their lifestyle um, and a couple of examples of this are like their particular religion or political views or their sexuality and all those kinds of really important things that make people who people are if you really want to be their friend you kind of have to realize that even if your view is different to theirs you have to accept them for having those views um it might mean that you have you get to have serious discussions with them and you kind of your relationship develops that way or you know whatever um but you kind of got to support them through their kind of what they've chosen as their life you can't change that um so you kind of have to just accept it and support them with it. Um, along with support, um, it's not just those kinds of like lifestyle choices, but also like um, with like mental illness and stuff. Um, because I have friends who are part of the LGBT community. I have friends who suffer from various different mental illnesses. I have friends who struggle financially, I have friends who don't struggle financially, I have friends, you know, different people's lives happen in different ways, different things happen to different people, that's sort of cliched stuff, um, and you just kind of got to find the people that you enjoy being with, um, because pretty much from when you're a teenager onwards, they're the people you're going to have more kind of contact with um with as far as like workmates go you don't technically have to be friends and hang out with them outside of work but being able to accept that that's who that person is is gonna help you to have an easier time at work and not have so many like issues with particular people that are more difficult to deal with um, because of who you are and who they are and that kind of thing um, so um, yeah and the reason I'm kind of talking about all this like serious stuff is I am I have a friend at the moment who's like I said um, going through some mental health issues and that kind of thing they're trying to like sort out their love life because they really want to have a love life and they don't um i don't particularly think that's terribly important but it is to them so that's one of those like accepting kind of things um yeah they're trying to get work i think they're trying to look they're looking at doing some study or something too um and there's just a couple of little like issues that are really big issues to them um, that they're trying to like sort through at the moment um, and then I have another friend um, who happens to also be my editor for um, popcorn where I'm up where I write articles and stuff um, and he's part of the LGBT community and so he's got um, he's trying to move away from having a lot of movie content in the magazines and branch out into a wider kind of entertainment 
feel. Um, and so I kind of was talking to him and was mentioning different things that he could kind of look into. Um, things like video games and comic books and music and all that kind of thing to kind of get away from the just movie release news stuff um, for that. Um, there's also like other than having those kinds of friends that you you know you talk to a lot more to try and make sure that you're supporting them enough you'll also have friends who um, don't need your support so much um, and then I have a friend like that um, where I'm able to just like have a bit of a laugh with him on, on Facebook and stuff um, which is all good fun um, and yeah so you'll have some friends that are not so much high maintenance but just require more care I guess than others um, and it's just kind of knowing how to treat those people um, without, you know, criticising them too heavily. Um, that kind of, I don't know, makes you a good person, I guess. Um, yeah. If you like this video, guys, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to leave a comment down below if there's any other kinds of issues you'd like me to talk about. I've been told that I give fairly good advice, so maybe I could start doing some like advice videos if anyone's interested. Um, and if you haven't already, please hit the subscribe button because I make new videos every day. Um, and with all of that out of the way guys, keep your spread and bright, and I'll catch you all tomorrow.